Hey everybody, J&A Review, and today we are at Triple H RVs here in Haleyville, Alabama. Now today we're going to be looking at a 2023 Salem Hemisphere travel trailer. The model number is 308RL, and this is by Forest River, so let's get started. The length on this travel trailer is 38 feet 7 inches. The dry weight is 9,063 pounds, and that hitch weight is 1,225. So, looks like you might have to have a nice truck for this one. This one is a little bit long, so let's point out just a couple of things. Your water connections and sewer connections, your outside shower. It's all actually in a really, really good location. You've got some storage right here. This is going to be under your bed. We'll show you that from the inside. Your pass-through storage is going to be here. All right, let's go around and take a look at the campsite. This is going to have two power awnings with LED light strips. Here's the other side of your pass-through storage. Electric stabilizers. Yes, these do have electric stabilizers. And you have a leash latch here if you want to bring your pets with you. So let's go on inside and take a look. This is a rear living model. Um, some people would call these a flat fifth wheel because they do have a fifth wheel layout. So we'll just start right back here at the back. You're gonna have a tri-fold sofa here that's going to um, fold out for some additional storage. <laughs> storage, sleeping. You can store people on it, I suppose. Yeah. Big window. Oh man. Storage cabinets all the way across Gross. the top. There are end tables on both sides with power Ooh. and USB. That's got a little hole. Oh. Yeah, there um, looks like there's storage, storage on both sides. Very good. Right here in your slide out, you're gonna have your theater seating with cup holders and got some storage right in there with a USB and your theater seating if you have a seat here is just directly across from your entertainment. Nice large Sansui TV up here. They give you a Furion sound bar right below it and a little storage cubby and an electric fireplace that can be pretty or actually used to put off some heat on those cooler mornings. Finishing out on your slide over here where I am, you've got a freestanding table and chairs nice big windows. big windows that's going to be on your campsite so you're going to have a great view they give you a large this it's is a very large huge island huge island it is got plug in here on the outside nice large stainless steel sink spray faucet this is a huge island i'm this still amazed at how huge. big it is you can have a taco bar right here definitely on the other side, you have three openings, cabinets there. Underneath your sink, got plenty of room for a garbage can. Yep. Right back here, microwave. Three burner Furion cooktop with an oven Ooh, and a matching drawer below it. I like that. Yes, love the matching drawers. They give you a bank of three drawers right there and some storage. And that is actually a wide, um, your, your countertop up there is oh, wide. Yeah, well, I thought you still about the cabinet. <laughs> well, it is, yeah, it's pretty deep. You've got a power and USB. You do have your 12 volt compressor fridge here. Ever chill. Nice. Right, let's check out this. Coming right on around. You're gonna have Ooh. a motion sensor light, pantry. Nice shelves right there. Too. Let me back up and show you your your AC unit right there. Over here, nice little coffee bar area, storage there. Power and USB. And you'll see this is prepped for the uh, King 
system if you want to add that Wi-Fi system in there. Your fuses, you're going to be right there at the end. All right, well, the kitchen area looks absolutely great. Let's move on down the hall. Here we go. Control right. panels are going to be right up here. Coming into your bathroom. Nice wow, large shower. A nice shower. Yeah, Jeremy is six feet tall, so they put yeah. the skylight in a great place. Yeah. So you can have a few more inches there. There's not a very big step up, so that's nice and convenient to get into. Your linen closet here. It's pretty deep. That's gonna be as it's gonna be as long as your shower is. Oh my goodness. So as wide, so great fan up here. They give you a couple of hooks for your towels or robes. That is right above your foot flush porcelain toilet. Medicine cabinet over here. Very good size sink. You can actually get two hands in that one. Mm -hmm. Storage below and they do give you a cubby there if you want to add a little waste basket. That's cool. Okay well let's move into the bedroom here. You're going to have a king size bed on a slide. You've got windows on both sides that will open for some ventilation. They, this one does come with a second air already installed. It's a direct dump too. And it is a direct dump. Here is your storage and you will see that that's where it was open to the outside. They give you some little storage ledges on both sides. That's pretty cool. Got and your slow rise shades. Slow rise shades is. Okay. Right. You've got power and USB. A sliding door to close this room off. Mm -hmm. If TV. you want want to add your TV, your power and uh, connections all right up there. You have a three drawer dresser right at the foot of the bed. Nice size. <clears throat> Okay, right across the front is going to be your nice large shower, your, um, shower, shower. <laughs> it's a closet. <laughs> I was looking at the water connection. Okay. I'm, I can cut that out. I need some caffeine. Um, right up here at the front, you've got a nice large closet. This is going to be prepped for a washer. Your dryer will actually go on the other side. love these nice large sliding doors and, oh that's and, cool yes your this is where your dryer will go if you want to add that you do have a hanging bar there that's in between so great size closet man so if you like the fifth wheel layout but you don't want the steps this might be a unit that you would like to consider <clears throat> All right, everybody. If you like this travel trailer, dealership's information, uh, telephone number be down in the description. And like always, if you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe. And also give us a thumbs up on this so we can mess with uh, YouTube's algorithm. All right. Thanks, everybody.